11 talented athletes accompanied by Turks and Caicos officials, dignitaries, and of course the media left this morning for St. Kitts and Nevis. Let's take a look. Now that state-of-the-art sporting facilities like the Gustavus Lightbourne Sports Complex and the National Track and Field are in place, athletes in the Turks and Caicos are working to get on par with regional and international competitors. As these 11 teammates of the National Carifta team boast of great days of fun, competition, and gold medals ahead, they can only achieve those goals if they demonstrate teamwork, uniformity, and discipline. The Honorable Dr. Carlton Mills, during an early morning pep talk with the TCI team, said that he is optimistic about the trip and our athletes. This is the year for us to acquire, um, bring back some more medals to the Turks and Caicos Islands. That will do us proud. As you know, um, these are defining moments for us in sports. Um, we have recently beaten St. Lucia here. Our cricket team uh, went down to Argentina recently and won the uh, America's Cup. And um, if you notice, as you said just now, um, from 41 to 10, because we're focusing on quality, not quantity now. And these are quality athletes. And uh, you, you can, you, it, it was a testament um, of their performance just recently in the inter high school games. And I do feel this year that we're going to bring a couple of medals back home. Over 20 countries are expected to compete this weekend at the 37th annual Carifta Games, known as the Caribbean Olympics. And more than 300 top athletes will fight for the gold. This is the year for Turks and Caicos at Carifta. We got one of the best teams that we've ever assembled and they, they are around a good um, group of coaches, both male with Judith and Mr. Gavi and of course Mr. Jewels. And I also would like to add too, we're taking sports to the next level. This year we're going to be um, um, providing each of the islands with one, a sports development officer and um, also we're looking at bringing in some specialist Cuban coaches. Um, for the throws, for the jumps, and for the sprints. In fact, we're hoping that um, all of this will be approved, and by May, June, we'll be going down to Cuba to recruit some of the world's best coaches to come into Turks and Caicos Islands and to coach our athletes, because we feel that we, can only take the, we are only taking them to a, a level here in the Turks and Caicos Islands. We need to take them beyond that. The Carifta Games begins on Saturday, March 22nd, and happens at the Bird Rock Athletic Stadium in St. Kitts and Nevis. We, we believe in you. You know that song, say, I believe. We believe in you. Um, it, it is my desire that to provide more opportunities for you in sports. And I think this is just the beginning for you. You know, we're, we're focusing now a lot on sports here in the Turks and Caicos Islands. But um, when you go down to Carifta, your performance will not only be viewed by persons within the Caribbean, but coaches will be there. Uh, uh, scouts will be there looking at you. So you have an opportunity now to not only shine within the Caribbean for the Turks and Caicos Islands, but the possibility of acquiring scholarships to take yourselves to the next level, take your careers to the next level. So this is a golden opportunity. 